welcome friends to a new episode of Ark Modded on Nuninaki. <laughs> I can't pronounce that word. But no sooner than we la ended off the last episode on the fire area where I was flaming, I went to go land and hang out for a little bit. I started to fall and I ran out of stamina right around this area. And then my guy just started going down and I got stuck in a tree. Well, I made the wonderful, really bad, terrifying, devastating button press of E and I jumped off and then I fell to my death. So that's where we are. Woohoo! Fantastic. So I guess I'll choose these and we'll choose my bed. And I think I've lost my pterodon, which really sucks. And yeah, logging in, look at, there we go. Perfect, there we go. Getting back at it. I'm hot, I need to find a place to cool down. And I don't know, I've probably lost my pterodon. I've lost all of my stuff. I have nothing. I got my turtle. I got both my Dilophosauruses. And I think we're good. So I'm gonna have to probably go tame up another, another one. Because that's, if I look at the map, that's on an island. The only way to get to the island is to fly. So that's kind of a bummer. So I think I'm going to get all my gear back to normal. So I'm going <laughs> to craft up all the stuff that I was missing. And I will bring you back when, we were, when we're done. All right. See you in a bit. All right, guys. We are back. And as you can see, I've got a couple of pterodons next to me flying. I've picked up two of them on the other side of the... Uh, bay, which is pretty nice. So I got them going and it looks like we now have two flyers and two Dilophosauruses. Pretty cool. All right, are we gonna have them land? Hey, hey you, land. <laughs> They're just flying around. I don't remember the key sequence to have them stop. But, hey. Oh, man. Well, I'm going to get them to land. <laughs> and we'll figure this out in a minute. All right, we are back. And I've got a couple of pterodons. And it looks like they're mate boosted even, which is super cool. Because now we have a male and a female. Which means we can start making eggs, which is super awesome. Look at that. I didn't even try to do that. That was just an accident that happened. So that's pretty cool. We got a 176 and I think a level 80, which is super awesome. 176, level 80. And we need names for all the stuff. We got Spitz. We can't, I don't think we're going to be able to change him, guys. I really don't because he did such a badass job uh, making sure we stayed alive in those first episodes. It was really good. And then a level, I think 81. We need a name for him. And then our turtle, you know. This guy, carbon -e -bene 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 -bene. We need we need a name for him too. So if you guys want to leave some comments down below, um, I'm sure you guys probably put some in the uh, first and second episode and stuff like that. Really awesome stuff. I appreciate it. So now what I want to get into today, now that we've got, we're pretty much back to whole. Um, I do have another forge, which I went and got a whole bunch of metal and I've just been crafting it up, you know, letting it go. We've been getting as much metal as we can because here's the other thing we need to do. I need to go back and get some of those crystals. That's one thing I have not yet replaced. So we've got tons of metal, which is great. 90 metal. We can put that in our uh, smithy here and we can get our last piece back. And there's actually another thing I want to make. Um, melee. I want to make the sword, which is super cool. I just want to do it because it's going to look super awesome. So let's take this up and then we're going to go to uh, the primitive and melee and oh wait, okay, melee and we need to make this guy, there we go, and we'll get our, our uh, hatchet back, which is good. So I'll probably make another one of each of these just so I have them, which is super cool. And there we go. Let's take a look at the sword. It's going to look so sweet look at that me ninja <laughs> me and my sweet dad bought her a ninja ninja sword wow <laughs> that's <was> awesome <laughs> okay so one thing we wanted to start working on today 
is irrigation. So I put all these all these things away last episode. We're going to put you there. And we're going to put the pipes here. And we're going to put these guys here. Come on, pipes. Don't fail me now, pipes. Is it because I can't see them all the way? There we go. There we go. And this guy. So we are going to get water going. <laughs> <laughs> we got this sword. Wow. Okay, so let's take a look at what these each do. Um, I'm not quite sure. We haven't done a lot with the irrigation, but I think we need the intake pipe first. And we need to put that in the water. The stone intake for irrigation network that transports water over land. Okay, well, let's do that. So we need a number five. And I guess let's just kind of chunk that in the water here. Cool. There we go. We got one. Awesome. So let's do number six. Which. And maybe this isn't going to work that well. You know, I'm glad I kind of made two of these. So what are the options here? Demolish. Okay, well, I don't, I don't know that I can connect anything to that. Let's see if we can snap this guy to it. Can we? We got our water reservoir to that, which is super cool. So we can access that. This is going to help us fill up our stuff, um, which is great. And I think, no, number six. It's obstructed, so I don't know. I may have to demolish this all. Shoot. It doesn't really work. Like, I think I have to get that up out of the water a little bit more. It's not really working. Hmm. What about number eight? I don't think I need, I don't think I really need it because like now I have water flowing and I think I can fill, I can fill everything up here. Use water items or rain to fill up the tank or place it to a connected permanent water source, 10 slots. Well, I guess what we should do is take a flyer. I thought I was going to need more of this stuff, but maybe this is all we need. So let me get on our big guy here. And let's go over to the top of the mountain up here, which is where Zog told us these crystals were. And I think because we need crystals to make the, the water bottle. So let's get some of these and see what we can do. So let's jump up here real quick. We'll land, we'll get some crystals. I think they're up over this way, right in the middle. Pretty cool. Wow, this is looking really good. So another thing that you guys might notice is that I might not have the best quality when it comes to my videos. It's because I, I don't know why, but maybe it's modded. or And I've never really had the best quality ARC videos as it is. But um, one thing that you guys, if you guys want to let me know what settings maybe I should be checking out because... Um, there's a few things that I want to do to make it better just so it looks a little bit better, but I still need good performance too, right? So if I'm not getting good performance, I shouldn't even really play the game. I know it might not look the best, but maybe you guys that are have been playing for a while that have a little bit lesser machines, kind of like me, can maybe kind of point me in the right direction on what the best settings are. Uh, let's take a look. I'll show you what my settings are right now, and you guys can look. I, I'm at medium. And, you know, a lot of this stuff is kind of down. So, I, you know, I got most of this stuff off. I know that these three, the sky quality, the ground clutter, and the mesh go down really quick. And I think we can really mess with the resolution scale. I think helps too. But if does do any of these other things mean anything? Because that's another thing that I want to look at too. Oh, oh, this seems to be a little bit snappy. Oh, I like this. this. I'm working real nice now. Oh, let's get the metal, man. Okay, so we got, we're getting some metal. I'm leveling up. We've got crystals. Yeah, so I'm just going to keep doing this for a while and get a whole bunch of materials here because that's going to be super nice to be able to take like all this metal back and like put that in our refining forges and we're going to be like in the metal arena. We really don't have to worry about metal now, which is super nice. Wow, 500 metal, 600 metal. <laughs> Holy man. Yeah, we have a lot of this stuff kind of jacked up so we can get stuff um, faster for you guys. But this is super cool. I like this. Wow. Really? A thousand metal? All right. What? 
<laughs> it's 800 metal. Nice. Can you fly? Super slow? No, you can't fly at all. <laughs> That's really not good at all. I think I have to drop some of this. So let's take a look and see if there's some of this we can drop. Um, that's just, maybe I can just do this. Drop the item. Are we fast now? Can we fly? Yes, okay, cool. All right, I'm gonna get back to base and we can then make the, uh, the, the water bottles. All right, we'll be we'll be on me. All right, guys, we are back, and I've made it back to my base. And whoa, we don't want to do that. No, no, no. <laughs> we want to access this guy. We're gonna put our keratin in there, and we're gonna make some cementing paste. And it looks like we are gonna be short by one. Oh man, I think that's what we need. Water. Is that what we need? One. Seven, <laughs> seven cementing paste. Dang it, I wish I wouldn't have lost all the keratin when I fell out of the sky. All right, guys, we made it back, and I got a little bit more keratin. Uh, just 65, I killed a turtle, and um, got a little bit more. Let's make one more, and then we can make this water bottle. I should probably make all of them. You know what, we'll just, just make all of them. Because I'm going to make two water bottles and water we also need hide let's get some hide okay cool so now we are safe from having to worry about getting in the water so if we go over to the fire island and stuff which we figured out is definitely not necessarily the best uh <laughs> the best the best thing I don't know we're gonna have to get some pretty special armor or bump our fortitude way up so we don't get kind of hurt because you pretty much start dying as soon as you land on the ground it's really scary over there but <laughs> alright let's make these water bottles this should be cool alright let's make two of those there we go and we have leveled up put this down here we don't need a tap okay we'll put those away and we've got water eight we drank it so now let's see if we put this in here if we put the water jar in there boom will it fill up or does it not work like that Hmm. <laughs> I don't think that works. So we're going to have to figure out how <laughs> to do that. I think, maybe you guys know, I think I have to move, I think I'm going to have to break this down and make new ones and then use, what do I have here? Um, the irrigation pipe. And then I think I'm going to have to do this guy to get the tap water. Maybe if I hold it, what if I hold it in my hand? Ooh, that's not what I wanted to do. Well, <laughs> either way, maybe you guys know. If you do, let me know so I can... Ooh, level 46, 47. Sweet. So <laughs> let me know what you guys think and uh, how to do that. Maybe you guys have a better idea. But as always, guys, don't forget to like and share your favorite social media. I'll catch you guys in the next episode.